Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What ATF form for SBR? To understand which ATF form is required for a short-barreled rifle SBR, it's essential to delve into the regulations and processes surrounding the National Firearms Act, NFA. An SBR is defined as any rifle with a barrel length of less than 16 inches or any gun with a barrel under 16 inches that has been fitted with a buttstock. When an individual or entity intends to make or register an SBR, they must comply with the NFA regulations. The key form for this purpose is the ATF Form 1. ATF Form 1. The ATF Form 1, also known as Form 5320.1, is the application used to make and register an NFA firearm, such as an SBR, for individuals or entities that do not hold a federal firearms license, FFL. This form allows individuals to convert existing firearms into SBRs, such as converting an AR lower into an SBR by using an upper receiver with a barrel length shorter than 16 inches. Process and requirements. To complete the Form 1, applicants must provide demographic information, attach a photograph, and submit fingerprints. The application also requires the payment of a $200 tax, which is part of the NFA tax stamp fee. Applicants can submit the Form 1 electronically, which is generally faster and less prone to errors compared to paper submissions. Electronic submissions through the ATF eForm system can result in processing times of a few months, especially when filed in the name of a trust. State and local laws. It is crucial to verify that SBRs are legal in your state and local jurisdiction before submitting the Form 1. Certain states and local areas have specific restrictions or prohibitions on SBRs. Additional considerations. For applications involving trusts or legal entities, additional forms such as the ATF Form 5320.23, National Firearms Act, NFA, Responsible Person Questionnaire, must be submitted for each responsible person associated with the trust or entity. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.